Morning, so it's Monday morning again. Um, definitely seems to be Monday morning more than all the other weekday mornings. Um, so I'm just about to leave for work. Caden is still in bed again. Um, I don't know if he actually stays asleep through all my banging around and stuff, but he's still in bed. Um, I said to him yesterday, like, it's still, if you don't have to get up and actually, like, get dressed and go to work early early even if you're awake it's like it's not quite the same because you can like have a more gentle start at least that's how I feel but he reckons if you're awake you might as well get up anyway but it's not the same as it like you can just chill out take your time a bit more so even if he is awake now I think it is I still prefer a slower start in the morning um so I'm off to work I don't think it's supposed to be too busy today. I hope I haven't jinxed myself now. Um, so um, I shall see as I haven't been there since Wednesday so hopefully everything's gone okay. And uh, I've got my labels for packing roses. Uh, I'm going to be running out at this rate, the amount I'm packing all the time. Um, and my, um, I've got a few bits, baby bits my dad's bringing over. So hopefully be a good day. Um, it is a dancing day. And I did want to keep going until the end of March, because that's when the term finishes. But I don't think I'm going to be able to. I'm just, like, my energy levels have really dropped now. And also, I'm, like, quite uncomfortable just walking. <laughs> um, and sleeping is harder, because my back aches. So I don't think I'm going to be going. Um, but in case some miracle happens, my bag is in my car. The Brit Vlog. Nine cat approved. So I guess I sort of did jinx myself. It's been really busy this morning. Um, it's already half past one and it, well, doesn't feel like any time at all really. So quite like those days though. And it hasn't been like bad busy. Um, there wasn't that much going out. I think I've sent out four or five. So I suppose, I suppose it's fairly busy, but the phone has been crazy. Like literally um, for the first two and a half hours this morning, the phone was just ringing non-stop. Um, like I was so thirsty, I, was, <laughs> I literally was talking, like must have been at least two hours of talking, if you add it up, by half past 10. And I didn't get my breakfast, um, I was starving and I finally like made my breakfast at half past ten. It took me ages to actually make the breakfast because the phone was ringing and then um, and then another customer just happened to turn up to ask if they could have a van like um, just to drop in. Um, so I think it was probably gone 11 by the time I got breakfast. Um, and loads of bookings. This weekend is already fully booked for all the proper sized vans. We've got our little tiny van and a couple of cars left, uh, but really busy. So that's good. I mean, as I said, it's not been a bad, a bad morning and the day is obviously gone quickly. So quite like that day. Um, not a bad Monday. And I've just really managed to start doing other stuff that needed doing, like I've done the wages just now. So that's taken me a while. Um, sorted out like the bank and stuff. Uh, I've got paperwork that needs doing here, and then probably the phone's going to ring again this afternoon several times. Um, but nothing else due out now. Possibly a couple of things coming back, and then I can hopefully catch up on a couple of bits. My mum's supposed to be coming at some point soon to help. Um, finish off these trees from last week I really want to get those out but I don't know what's going to happen time wise and um, really nice day actually like it's sunny it's not too cold it's quite it's quite warm I mean probably if you're going out walking you'd probably need a coat but if you're just um, like as you're going in and out in the yard for a couple of minutes and stuff it's really nice so nice spring day for once nice we do end. What's going on? I'm a bit stuffed after those meatballs. What are you doing? What are you doing? Emailing myself, reminding me. 
How are we excited we've we bought? Need to go in the loft. We, we've, you need to go in the loft. Mm. We've bought Sky, Skyfall on Blu-ray. So I'm waiting for that to come so we can watch the James Bondage. Yeah. Very loud and very big. Uh, moderately loud. Very loud and very big. You can join me or you can, um, you could go off. We could listen to it upstairs. Yeah, you could sit upstairs and listen to it, yeah. We're out in the car. We're out in the car, yeah. Ah, you're funny. Good day. Yeah, that's right. That's a lot to do again. I finally sorted out the CCTV. Oh. Which I was having problems with. So that's all working. Good. Yeah. Good. There's some other stuff. Lots really. Lots going on. It's very tired. I've got to go. I've got to do my job so running tired. tomorrow. That's yeah. It's going to be lame. Pack your pee kit. Yeah, you got to pack your pee kit tonight. And your Tesco bag. And your Tesco bag because we can't afford a bag. <laughs> We're, 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 we're too poor. You could use my gym bag. No, it's a bit lame. Oh. It's got flowers on it and stuff. It's not got flowers on it. It's a plume. Top Gear's amazing. It's hilarious. It was quite funny. Yeah. We have to wait till next week. Yeah. Because you didn't save up the two. No. I, I so couldn't wait. watch it like normal people. I was being, um, being impatient. No. I know it's quite hard for you to be. No. Sometimes I get a little bit impatient. No. Mm. Can't it does believe happen. that. It doesn't happen often, but it does happen. Can't believe that. I had an incident with the glue gun today. Oh, have you showed, oh, showed them the incident? No, I haven't. You showed them the incident. Yeah. Go on, then. You take the camera. Oh. This one's not bad. Do you want to see the other one? Well, we want to see the bad one. We're not interested in the non bad one, are we? No. Oh, it's stuck on now. Use it like stuck it onto like the weeping blister. If you don't know, if you get a burn, put cling film on it. Like Everyone knows the cling film trick. Stops the burning. Pepsi Cat knows the cling film trick. But I think I might have to go to Boots tomorrow. What for? Go to fresh aloe plant in the kitchen. Get like I don't know. Ask the pharmacist. Well, I'm Google says sure. that you're supposed to have like a a a gauze dressing. Because you shouldn't keep the cling film on, like, forever. Oh, I thought you were just going to have cling film for the rest of your life on the finger. Ah. Uh, uh, it's got worse. Yeah, uh, let's, let's see then. Which way's better? Where is it? Hold on, I'll try and zoom Where in. Where is it? Uh, <laughs> that's huge! Yeah! <laughs> what is that? Till it, till it towards the light. There. Oh, can't find it. I lost Massive it. blister. That is, that is disgusting. You're disgusting. Yeah, it's quite painful. Yeah. And then like, because it dripped right from the glue gun so it was as hot as it could be. And then I went like with my thumb to brush it off so then uh, I burnt my thumb. That was clever. Yeah, that's why. Yeah. <laughs> but that's only a second. So you've got area. two. I've got my broken thumbed. My thumb's not too bad. We're all, we're all broken. Aidan won't let his air. No. Because I might catch it, the, the and that would be skin might that would caught. be incredible. That would be the most pain ever. That would make childbirth look like a, like a paper cut. We doing that, Pete? <laughs> Have to get some flowers. We doing? Can you fit through there? That was hard work climbing the ladder now. Oh, that looks fun. It's cold up here. I want to edit the vlog, so you get <coughs> going to say good night. Oh, I'm not sleeping up here though. It's too cold. Oh, but you can't do anything if I just put the ladder back up and shut it. Aww. Bye! <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Bean! Bye.